This is the story of Blinky Bill and Flap and Nutsy too. And Wombo Ruff and Marcia and Splugs the Kangaroo. Now they all live in Green Patch Town as happy as can be. With friends and neighbours all around, the same as you and me. But it's not always fun and games for Blinky and his crew. Disasters shouldn't happen, but alas, they sometimes do. There's mysteries and secrets out there amongst the trees. And nobody needs enemies when you've got friends like these. Hey, hey, Blinky Bill, you'll never catch him standing still. Life is pretty boring till you've met Blinky Bill. Hey, hey, Blinky Bill, our cheeky mate from Green Patch Hill. If you don't know him, you soon will. Good old Blinky Bill. So come and see what happens next to Blinky and his friends. But ten to one, you'll never guess the way the story ends. Our little mischief maker, the one who never fails. Enjoy his great adventures in these new exciting tales. Hey, hey, Blinky Bill, you'll never catch him standing still. Life is pretty boring till you've met Blinky Bill. Hey, hey, Blinky Bill, our cheeky mate from Green Patch Hill. If you don't know him, you soon will. Good old Blinky Bill. Oh. Hey, hey, Blinky Bill, you'll never catch him standing still. Life is pretty boring till you've met Blinky Bill. Hey, hey, Blinky Bill, our cheeky mate from Green Patch Hill. If you don't know him, you soon will. Good old Blinky Bill. Good on you, Blinky. This is crocodile country. Crocodiles? Oh, I don't see any crocodiles. Because there aren't any. Huh, crocodiles! Just leather suitcases waiting to happen. Come on, whips! Last one in, it's a dummy! Watch out! Here we come! Ah. Well, I don't need a swim. I'm wet enough already. Oh, come and join us, Shifty. Help! Help! Try standing up. <sighs> this is the life. I'm going to wear my clothes in the bath from now on. It'll save me the bother of undressing. Yeah, your mum won't like that. Well, she should be pleased. You won't have so much washing. Well, we've got to find our way home first. Oh, don't worry about that now. Meanwhile, <laughs> let's enjoy ourselves. <laughs> What's young? Did you see a crocodile? No, but I think there's some piranhas down there. Piranhas? There aren't any piranhas in Australia. They just look like friendly fish to me. Oh, forget the fish. Let's have a race around that corner. Ready? Go! Wait for me! <laughs> I won! You cheated! You started before you said go! I didn't! Well, you must have. Everyone knows platypuses swim better than koalas. Anyway, I've had enough swimming. I'm gonna sunbake on that rock. Mm, it'll be too hot for me. Grilled platypus! <laughs> That'll be a crocky snack. <laughs> I don't think you should make jokes like that. Ah, peace and quiet. Away from juvenile antics. <laughs> the last one is a cream puff. What we got here? A shrimp? Oh, all right. 
Maybe a water beetle? Jar is a juicy little grub. <laughs> Please, don't make me. Hey, you crocodiles! Save me, Blinky! Leave that platypus alone, or you'll be luxury luggage! Well, I wish she'd learn how to negotiate. Knock it off, sister! We're not gonna eat you, pal. We're not allowed to have snacks. We're in training! For the Iron Croc Contest. The Iron Croc Contest? It's a competition to find the toughest croc. It takes place every three years, and the winner gets to be top croc. He gets to boss everyone. I'm gonna be top croc. Who says? I do. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Think you're good, do ya? I know I'm good. Let's see how you handle this. Yeah, ow, ow, ow. you want to play rough. <laughs> oh, yeah, hold in one. Hi! I guess we were wet already. Let's go. I don't care if I never see another crocodile. Taking them on just might have been fun. You can't do this. The fire's out. Oh, I'm ready for sleep. I hope those crocodiles are safely tucked up in bed. <laughs> These moffies aren't. <laughs> what a mosquito eat when there's no platypus. They like kangaroos for afters. Ouch! Do you think we're safe, Blinky? Crocodiles wouldn't want to sleep in these old rocks. Oh, why must I always get a stone in my back? Well, I gotta sleep. Yeah, quick winch and dummy! When I think about all the fuss I made going to my nice, soft, comfortable bed back home. Ah, that's better. Now no nasty old croc can creep up behind me. Flip. <laughs> Bunch of sleeping beauties. Where is everybody? Oh, oh, I knew it. They've gone off and left me. I, oh, there they are. <laughs> if that's one of your jokes, Flap, I don't think it's funny. Do helping for cornflakes, please, Mum. Oh, stop pretending to be asleep. Hey, hey stop it. I'm sorry. A, a, a crocodile. Little animal, oh, I'm surrounded. <laughs> Marcia's right. We didn't run from the other crocodiles. We didn't cuddle them all night either. Come on, croc! Show yourself! Promise you won't hit me? Ha! I wouldn't lay a finger on a worm like you! <laughs> That's all right, then. You never know quite where you are with strangers. But now that I've seen you, I think you all look very nice. I'm Cyril. Oh, Marcia Mouse. I'm Blinky Bill. And this is my gang. Pleased to meet you, I'm sure. Ask him if he's got friends or relatives with him. Um, are you here on your own? Completely, utterly alone. <laughs> oh, oh, don't start that again. We'll be soaked. Lend him your hanky, Blinky. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Why don't you tell us what's wrong? Well, you wouldn't be interested in me. Oh, of course we are. Well, if you're really sure, 
It all starts with my dad. Have you heard about the Iron Rock Contest? Yes. Well, my dad's won it more times than anyone else. He's been boss croc for ages. He's the biggest, toughest croc of them all. So when he got a family, he wanted them to be just like him. Go. Get his rod. Go. Wayne. You. Duart. And me. Yes. But somehow I was different. <laughs> My brothers always teased me. <laughs> oh, but Mother said I was the most beautiful baby she'd ever seen. Dad said it was her fault that I wasn't like the others. It's just that I wasn't interested in the sort of games Rod and Wayne and Duat played. As we got bigger, Dad said he was going to retire from the Iron Croc Contest. And one of us would have to be Top Croc. He had us training, but he kept saying that I didn't have the right motivation. Hey. I kept on training, but one day I thought what I'd really like to do was to find a nice present for my dad. I thought a lovely bunch of flowers would cheer him up because none of us would ever be as great a top clock as him. I knew he was trying really hard to help us to be big, tough clocks like him. So, when I gave him the flowers, I gave him a great big kiss to show just how much I loved him. But I forgot that he didn't like being kissed. He said I was a disgrace and no son of Top Croc. Ooh, he said I was old enough to look after myself until I proved I was a true crocodile. <laughs> so you see, I'm all on my own and <laughs> I miss my mummy. <laughs> So much. Oh, no, how you feel? I miss my mummy. Me too. Ah, I wish I was a croc. I'd eat the lot of them. I'm just real glad that's not my hanky. Oh, can't we help Cyril Blinky? Well, um... Yeah, it's not much fun having no home to go to. Oh, we all know how that feels. Yeah, that's we right. Do. Yeah. Okay, okay. I might just have an idea. Hey, hey, Cyril. Yeah? The winner of the Iron Croc contest becomes Top Croc, right? Well, yes. And he gets to boss all the others around. Yes. Then you've got to win the Iron Croc contest. Yeah, me? His dad couldn't argue then. Oh boy, think of being Boss Croc. Zap! Pow! <laughs> I wish I was a croc. Hey, that's a great idea, Blinky. Uh, well, no, it jolly well isn't. Why not? All the other crocodiles are such dreadful cheats and bullies. No, no, I, I, I couldn't. I won't. I'll just have to go away and hide from everyone. Ah, oh, don't be silly, Cyril. We'll help. You. But you're all so little. Well, I'm not that little. Hey, just what's wrong with being little, Mr. Smarty? <laughs> nothing, nothing. I apologize. Right then. Now, tell us all about the contest, and we'll see what we can do. <laughs> oh, it's no use. I can't reach. Look, we can all touch toes, dummy. <laughs> Hey, I've lost mine. I... Oh, there they are. I don't see how touching my toes will help me deal with those cheating crocodiles. We'll worry about the cheats. You just get in training. So, touch your toes, dummy. Now. Oh. Hey, that's more like it. Now, next routine, everyone run on the spot. Hey, what do we have to do it to? Cyril needs encouragement. Why can't I just stand still and cheer? Won't hurt you to lose some fat. 
Hello, me, everyone. Why is it that Blinky Fighty is always needs so much energy? It was never fun like this when we trained with Dad. <laughs> Where's Cyril? Here I am! <laughs> wow, that was great. Hey, what's next? <laughs> Again. Well, I reckon you're ready for the Iron Croc contest now, Cyril. Yep, you beat them all. Guy for gold. You really think so? You can win it. Won't your dad have a surprise? Yeah, and your brothers. Yes, everyone will be there, won't they? I. No, I can't do it. I can't. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's wrong now? Everyone knows what I'm like. All they'll do is laugh. How right they'll be? They'll say that it's only Softy Cyril. But if they don't know it, you... But don't be silly, Blinky. Of course they'll know it's me. Not if you're disguised. Disguised? Who? Me? D do you think your mum will mind? Not if she knows what it's for. Can't we tell her? No, it's it's got to be a complete surprise. Okay, Cyril, you're the tallest. We'll call him Mum um, the Masked Raider. <laughs> Nobody will ever recognise him. I say, do you really think so? Well. As long as you don't talk. Oh, of course I won't. I'm not silly, you know. I wonder what I look like. Oh, my word. I look completely different, don't I? And you know what? I feel completely different. The masked raider, I think you said, Winky. Well, <clears throat> let's go get him. Step right up. Now, you wait here by the start, Cyril. We'll mingle with the crowd. <laughs> mingle, he says. I feel like a lost jelly bean at a birthday party. Hey, look! It's the fishy slack that we met at the water hole. <laughs> what are you doing here, shrimp? Waiting for tea time? Ha 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 ha! Leave my friend alone, you other grown suitcase! <laughs> it's a good thing that Softy Cyril's not here. Uh, he's scared of mice. <laughs> <laughs> Grab them, Splodge. We don't want trouble. Are you really my friend? Don't bank on it, dummy! Those crocodiles are going to be real hungry after the contest. Yeah, and I don't want to be emergency rations. Don't worry. Cyril will look after us when he's top croc. And if he doesn't get to be top croc... Attention everyone! The Top Croc Contest is about to begin. And this year, competing for the title of Top Croc, we have a mystery entrant, the Masked Raider. Give him a hand, boys! For a boot! 
<laughs> Haven't I seen that mask somewhere before? Maybe I should remind a mystery entrant there's no whinging allowed about cheating in the Iron Croc Contest. <laughs> there's only one rule. The first croc is top croc. Oh, do you think Sarah will be all right? Of course. Trust me. What comes first? Um, the crazy pole and the mud pit. That's my boy. Oh no! I thought they'd got rid of him. <laughs> Why are you hanging there trying to tickle my toes, Duat? Cyril! I expect he forgot. Top rocks aren't ticklish. <laughs> We'll have a lovely day. We're going on a bushwalk. Young Blinky yelled. Hooray! You gives it's blonde. I'm going to take a compass and a map. And I'll bring the essential, <laughs> like chocolate cake, said Flap. Yahoo! Did you eat too? Blinky Bill and all his crew. Nutsy Flap and Marsha too. And Splodge the Kangaroo. Splodge the Kangaroo. Splodge the Kangaroo. They wandered down an old bush track, a twisting and a turning, then crawled up on the bank and fell exhausted on the grass. An unfamiliar landscape stretched round them far and wide, and Flappy nearly fainted. We're completely lost! He cried. You want to know what happened? Then keep watching and you'll see. 
here comes the next adventure of Blinky Bill. Blinky Bill. Blinky Bill. That's me. Yahoo, did you do? Blinky Bill and all his crew. Nutsy Flap and Marsha too. And Spodge the Kangaroo. Spodge the Kangaroo. Spodge the Kangaroo. <laughs> <laughs>